guys. Welcome back to Saturday Night Action Day Gamer right here, right now. That's right, let's get this going. Um, anyways, right off the bat, I just want to give you guys a heads up right before we get into anything. Um, hopefully, if there is a video tomorrow for the Weird Podcast, that would be amazing. Um, if, but if there's no Weird Podcast tomorrow, the reason behind that is because, well, Alex kind of recorded uh, my, uh, my Weird Podcast for me. And uh, I, I wrote to him. I'll ask it if he, he, if he can give it to me soon, but um, if it's not up tomorrow, um, I do apologize uh, because, well, he has the audio and I don't, <laughs> so I'm hoping he can give it to me somehow soon and then we can definitely uh, put it up on the channel because I definitely want to give you guys the weird podcast as soon as possible on Sunday, so uh, hopefully we can do that. But uh, anyways, let's get into the world of gaming, so let's go to the gamer station and see what's happening. Alright, welcome to Game News. So anyways, right off the bat guys, we have, of course, Pokemon Go is available. Uh, and by that I mean the little gadget, little Mabara you can put on, it's like a little pin, you can put it on there, or wear it as a badge, or even a wristband. You can wear it now, you can buy it, uh, you can do all that stuff, and pretty much if you guys don't know what it does pretty much what you can do is that it little blinks uh, to let you know that you're either at a station to get you know collect uh, pokeballs and all that or at the same time you get to go to a place where pretty much it shows uh, that you can catch Pokemon and it'll tell you if you caught a Pokemon or not if it's green you caught a Pokemon if it's red you didn't catch Pokemon which is pretty sad to say but yeah you think like the gadget video like just let you know automatically that you caught the Pokemon instead of saying that it tried <laughs> just say you know it, it would be nice to just have it do that but eh whatever anyways the Guardian the last Guardian will be delayed till December that is right so if you guys were thinking of getting the game sooner or later well unfortunately it's gonna be delayed for a couple of months and I understand that this game we've been waiting for for years and years on since the PS2 era but the way I see is that if they can improve it more, then definitely, yeah, go for it. Just make this game great. We've been waiting for years, and I think what people want is that if it becomes the greatest like game that they, we enjoyed, besides the other games before uh, they made, then definitely, yeah, it would turn out the greatest thing I think a lot of people would love to see. So, but anyways, the last thing is uh, Assassin's Creed Ezio Collection is uh, announced. Literally, guys, you guys can check it out with the trailer and all that. Um, literally, it is the whole collector's edition of Ezio, pretty much from the beginning all the way to the end of his story. And I will say, if you guys have not played the Ezio stories or played even part of one and you stop, the way I see is that go play those games. And the reason I say that is because those stories are so great uh, for this character. And this is what made Assassin's Creed, by the way. And, and that's why I enjoy playing uh, the Ezio games. Like, I can go back and play those games once again because it's just one of the greatest, like, things, part of the franchise that I dearly enjoy was definitely Ezio. So. But anyways, that's it for Gaming News. So hopefully you guys are watching. Let's get back. This Saturday Night Action Game. Alright guys, that was game. Just hope you guys enjoyed watching. Anyways, it's very interesting. I think it's very interesting for the Ezio collection. Because I'm a big fan of Ezio. Like, literally. I, I love the story and everything, as I explained uh, a second ago. But yeah, no, it's it's definitely amazing. And I just, I just love... I wish there was more. I really wish there was more of him. But since they, I know they understand that they're going to another story, understandable... But I kind of wish they followed in that footsteps that they did with Ezio. Because I really miss the stories like that. Like for Assassin's Creed. So, um, But anyways, pretty much what's happening um, is uh, there's going to be new VR stuff. No, this is not part of TGS or whatever. But this is just something very interesting I found off the internet. Where pretty much it's where gloves for VR. So like if there's an object in the VR and you try picking it up. So like, let's say it's a rock or something, right? Of course your hand isn't going to pick up the hole. You know, you can't go through it, right? So the glove teaches, uh, knows what you're picking up and literally develops that in uh, the thing. So I think it's really cool like how that works for a reason. So I, I really like how they did that. And plus also like if it's like a rubber ducky, of course you can just squeeze it, right? It's very simple. I think it's the most interesting thing of all. So, um, 
but yeah, no, that that's the that's one thing I think is very interesting is that we're getting more advanced um, than just you know uh, the eye vision and you know hearing the environment and that. I think that's the really cool thing about it. But um, just having the gloves in general, I think we're getting closer and closer to learning how to put our whole bodies um, and feeling stuff a lot more for VR. So I think it's the coolest thing of all. So. But anyways, uh, if you guys are probably wondering why the videos are later, uh, because of a new schedule. So, I noticed for part of the week that um, when uh, when school started, that apparently, um, like, I, I guess you guys don't have a chance to watch the, uh, the videos in the morning. So, I started moving them towards the afternoon more because I'm just like, okay, well maybe it's a lot better this way than it is than having it the old way. Because that was, that was pretty much like for summer, right? Because you guys are, you know, everybody's off in the summertime pretty much. So, I understand that, you know, having the one in the morning and afternoon. But this time I kind of bumped it up um, to like around 3 o'clock or something like that. I know I haven't gotten that particular right uh, for 3. But anyways, I was trying one there and then I was having like another one later on, like a couple of hours after. So... I'm trying to see like what's a good time to put it up. Like I'm still trying to figure that out. So once that gets all fixed up, you'll start noticing the schedule just folding out as it will. And this week is actually gonna be a really good week for me to get videos very well and organized because I there's lots and lots of time on my hands this week. So I'm gonna try to get that going, and I think that's gonna be an amazing, amazing thing to do. So. But, uh, anyway, something that is also another game, Akiva's Trip is getting an anime show. Like, literally, if you guys don't know what that is, I have gameplay for you, you guys can watch. But anyways, it's pretty much about a guy who's a vampire, and, uh, there's our vampires trying to come after them. And the only way to, to pretty much take them out is by ripping their clothes off. Which might sound a little weird and odd, but that's what the game is. And that's pretty much how it works, so. Um... But yeah, that, that's pretty much it to say about that. But uh, anyways, um, there's not really our ep like update for news for the week. So uh, pretty much right now, we're going to the movies. The movie section, of course, which is Blair Witch. Um, I saw the old one. Well, I tell you, what, I didn't really go see the old one. My parents did. But they told me it sucked. And I heard some other people say it was pretty bad. Um, but I didn't see this one. Uh I'm not sure if I'm going to see this one or not. I have some Iron movies that I'm thinking of still watching. I didn't get a chance to watch some movies that came out recently. So I'm feeling I might go see them first uh, before going to see these. But anyways, um, Blair Witch is a horror movie, of course. You know, um, I think it's about a witch. Um, that's pretty much what it is. But I know they're in a forest and that, so. Uh, but anyways, next one. If you don't enjoy horror movies, then maybe this one. If you guys enjoy, I guess... Drama, I guess. I don't know. Uh, Bridget Jones' baby. Pretty much about two guys that are trying to figure out which one is their baby. Like, the one that she got pregnant with. So, yeah, they try to figure out who who's the father, pretty much. Yeah. It's, it's I don't know. It's, uh, it sounds like a little, like, rambling gambling game. It's like, who is it? Me or is it her? I don't know. I don't know. It, watch the trailer. You'll figure it out yourself. Like, how it is, though. So. But anyways, the last one is Soda. Now, this one's like a true story. This one's actually really interesting. This is where this guy, I guess he got into files or something, and then he became wanted or something. And then he, some, of the, some people think of him as a hero. Some people think of him as uh, a wanted guy and all that. So, um, that movie really caught my interest a lot more. But um, I, I definitely would like to see what that movie would be about because I, I don't know anything about it. Apparently, it's a true story about in the States. Um, so, I would love to see what that movie's about. But uh, other than that, that's pretty much it. So hope you guys enjoyed watching. Sorry that I actually get rid I know um, it wasn't really too, too much news and all that. But hey, you know what? still good enough, I guess. At least it's not like a minute episode, a video, right? That's that's the best part about it. So, but anyways, that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. That's all that matters. And I'll see you, of course, in the next videos. And uh, if Alex is watching this um, Saturday night, please give me the weird podcast. I need it for tomorrow, please, and thank you. Um, but anyways, that's it for now. Take care. Have a great day.